Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Pyden and Hunter Brown seldom come up in a debate about Sister Wise at the moment as the family has gone quiet regarding Cody Brown on social media. But something Pyden said made people suspect that one of the OG sons might be getting married, and it's not him. However, they also question if possibly he was taken out of context. Continue on to find out what TLC fans think. Pyden Brown used to drip snark on social media. After calling out Mary Brown for allegedly assaulting some of the kids, Christine Brown Woolley's son also plapped at his dad, Cody. But soon, he stopped doing that and started getting playful with his parents and Janelle Brown. In a recent video on TikTok, he assured his fans that soon he'd be going to his brother's bachelor party. The sister-wise dilemma as to which son is getting married seemed confusing because some TLC think it was an outdated post that went up. Also, some individuals assumed that the account it was on didn't belong to Pardon Brown. In any event, he did say that, and the exchange transpired when he talked to Christine Brown. Is one of Janelle Brown's sons marrying? Recently, Hunter Brown has been looking incredibly cheerful on Instagram. Additionally, Janelle is smiling as well. TLC followers claim that in one post, she implied that Hunter was getting engaged. So, Christine's son might suggest that he was going to a bachelor party for him. On the other hand, the post might be ancient and pertain to Logan Brown marrying Michelle Petty. On Reddit, a sister-wise devotee reported about a son of Cody Brown getting married. In the caption, the OP wrote, Which brother is getting married? Pyden claims on TT that his is going to his brother's bachelor celebration. In the conversation, Numerous suggestions were floated around. Here are some of them, including why TLC fans think if anyone is married then it's likely to be Janelle Brown's son, Hunter Brown. Probably Hunter, Logan is already married, and I doubt it's Gabe. That's probably an imposter repeating Payton's video from when Logan got married. Could this potentially be an older post, too, and Logan already married? I suppose it was in a description Janelle made in her Instagram that Hunter is engaged to his longtime lover, Audrey. That would be excellent news. Hunter is a good dude. They deserve to celebrate together again after so much grief. Probably Hunter. Logan is already married, and I doubt it's Gabe. What are your opinions regarding Pyden Brown admitting that he was going to a bachelor celebration for one of his brothers? Do you think the Sister Wise Algy post might be about Logan, who is already married? If one of Janelle Brown's boys is getting married, do you think it is probably Hunter Brown? Shout out in the comments below, and come back here often for all your Sister Wise news. Cody Brown's big polygamous family has gotten more fragmented than ever throughout the seasons. He has been getting all the wrath and criticism for his behavior towards his ex-wives and elder children. The sister-wise actor never admitted that he has favorites in polygamy, but it became clear to his family and the TLC viewers. He always valued his new wife and her kids over his prior marriages and children. Cody failed to develop a reputation among viewers because of his narcissism and toxicity in season 18. Several of his elder children, including Gwen, Savannah, Gabe, and Garrison, revealed their thoughts of being abandoned by their father in the previous season. Surprisingly, none of his children from his first three wives, Christine, Mary, and Janelle, wished him on Father's Day. Now, viewers question if the new family dynamics might affect the show's future. Sister Wives, Will Cody's poor relationship with family become the end of show? Sister Wise star Cody Brown failed to complete his responsibilities as a parent to many of his older children. He never showed up for his elder kids and abandoned them on their most crucial days. TLC viewers have seen him forgetting his kids' birthdays and not addressing his mistakes. Cody and his family's lives have changed radically since Mary, Janelle, and Christine excited. Fans have noted that none of the youngsters wished him on Father's Day this year. Previously, 
Mike Fatty and Cody's nephew Benjamin indicated that the new season is set to hit the screen by August. But looking at the new dynamics of the family has made fans question how the reality TV stars are managing their filming schedule. TLC fans have already witnessed a season where the spiritual wives were filming from different locations. Honestly, fans didn't find the season entertaining at all. Michael T has previously hinted that viewers would watch her dad living his monogamous life with his beloved bride. Moreover, she mentioned that Christine and David would be presenting their dating sequences in the future season. However, fans have no interest in seeing the couple's dating life after knowing that they have already tied the knot. Moreover, they wonder if the network would be left with no more plot if things didn't go better between Cody and his children. Further, many assume that the friction between family members can result in a show's discontinuation. Sister Wives Fans react on No Father's Day from older children to Cody Brown. Sister Wives actors have watched all the drama between Cody and his enormous polygamous family over the years. Now it seems that the Brown family youngsters are not even ready to wish their day on Father's Day. Recently, some Redditors commented how the elder children snubbed their dad on the important occasion on social media. One admirer stated, I don't blame his kids one bit for not posting anything to him. The admirer believed that Cody's children have all the right not to wish him on a special day due the way he treated them over the years. Moreover, a separate fan said, In fairness, anything the kids did post would be flooded with negativity, and they are already going through a lot. Further, others assumed that Robin must have major plans for her husband. Sister Wives chronicles Cody Brown and his marriage to his four wives. However, they are not polygamous anymore, after three of the wives left Cody within a year. Interestingly, all the members of this former union are now either in a monogamous relationship or prefer it over polygamy. During a recent podcast interview, Mary, Cody's first wife and the last to depart, spoke candidly about her thoughts on polygamy, her relationships with the other wives, and Cody. Mary reportedly indicated that she might have been the cause of what the Brown family looks like presently. The show also reasoned why Mary has always been so reserved. It also dug into her childhood and highlighted how feelings of jealousy are typical in polygamous partnerships. So, what is Mary Brown's stance on polygamy now? Learn all about it here. Sister Wives, Mary Brown, no longer wants polygamy. While participating on the Misunderstood with Rachel Ocatel podcast on June 11, Mary Brown discussed her early years with her former husband, Cody. The duo was fairly young when they crossed paths and decided to join a plural marriage. They hitched the knot when Mary was only 19 and Cody was 21. The Sister Y star mentioned that their dating time was non-existent, but Cody was very fond of her in the early years of their marriage. Interestingly, Cody claims to being the least interested in Mary in the present time. She described young Cody as fun and jovial. Although the former couple divorced in 2014, their relationship truly ended in 2023. Cody's preference towards one wife created a rift with the others, finally forcing Mary to depart as well. Describing her encounter with the other wives, Mary talked warmly. She outlined how the sister wives managed to communicate and establish a good environment to raise their children. The spouses raised all the kids together and never took any outside aid. Mary appreciated this, especially because she experienced fertility issues. She felt grateful for raising her lone child with her sister wives' children. Mary is no longer interested in entering another polygamous marriage or even getting married again. However, she feels polygamy can be effective if all partners focus on making equal efforts. She also acknowledged that the partnership can fall apart if even one person loses interest. With this statement, it appeared as if Mary had implied that she might have been the source of the Brown family's eventually parting ways. However, she did not go into any depth. Thanks for watching if you liked this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.